Okay, we've been following severe weather, the threat yesterday, the outbreak that happened last night, and still more threats to come today and tomorrow. At least 15 preliminary tornado reports have come into Fox Weather. We were live with the multiple vortexes they developed yesterday on radar, and those signatures were showing debris lofted as high as 13,000 feet into the atmosphere. This is a vantage point of the storm rotating in Cole, Oklahoma, the tornado on the ground there. This was the largest storm uh, to drop a tornado. It was just southwest of Blanchard, Oklahoma went through the small town of Cole in McLean County, Oklahoma, and we're looking at some of the damage. Basically, daylight showing a large area of destruction. This is a larger structure where the roof was completely blown off, but you do also you have some smaller structures in parts of the storm path where they were completely taken down right down to the foundation. Now, Cole is a rural town in McLean County. It's about 15 square miles, but the county itself is 580 square miles, and there is damage all across the county and even across the county lines. We just heard from the sheriff there in McLean. Now, we do have fatalities from this storm. Three people have died tragically, and it makes it the deadliest Oklahoma tornado since 2013. We'll continue to follow the storm as we analyze the damage and we get the reports in from the National Weather Service. We will then know what the EF rating for this particular storm is, but it looked like it was pretty destructive. Another component of this outbreak was hail damage. Now, the hail was huge in some cases. The reports went all the way up to four inches in diameter. But there were also across five different states, two inch in diameter or larger hail. So that's pretty significant that we had such large ice stones falling during the storm across such a large area. We also had additional tornado reports in Iowa and Kansas. So Crawford and Fremont in Iowa and also Chase County in Kansas. These are all areas that they'll be going out to look and survey the damage and we'll get more information as the day goes on. I'm Amy Freeze. Welcome to Fox Weather's YouTube page. We have more great videos on the way, so make sure to subscribe to stay updated on all things weather.